In this video, we compare Africa's largest country, Nigeria, and Asia's largest country, China. This is a side-by-side -side comparison between these two grids from entirely different regions, just to see their similarities and differences, and also to see how they stack up against each other. Before we hop into this video, kindly take a sec to hit our subscribe button below this video and push our notification bell to get notified each time we drop a video. Stay tuned. This is a side-by-side -side comparison between Africa's greatest country and Asia's greatest country. As we explore these two countries, we look at their population first. Nigeria's population is estimated to be 206,630,269, while China has an estimated population of 1,400,050,000. This makes Chinese population seven times greater than that of Nigeria. Now when it comes to life expectancy, the average life expectancy of men in Nigeria is 54.7 years and 55.7 years for women. This brings us to the average of 55.2 years. The average life expectancy of Chinese men is 74.5 years and for women 79.1 years. This brings us to the average of 76.8 years. Now this shows that with a difference of 21.6 years, China has a better life expectancy rate. Moving over to landmass, Nigeria has a land size of 923,769 km square. On the other hand, China has a land mass of 9,596,961 km square. This means that China's land mass is over 10 times bigger than that of Nigeria. Religion-wise, Nigeria has two major religions, Christianity and Islam, of which 45.9% of the country's population are Christians and 53.5% are Muslims. On the other hand, although with Buddhism being China's major religion, larger portion of the population have no religion at all. According to China's religion stats, 74.5% of its population have no religion, 18.3% are Buddhists, 5% are Christians, and 1% Muslims. When it comes to language, Nigeria is a very diverse country with 525 languages being spoken in its region, making it the third country in the world with the highest number of languages. Nigeria's official language is English, with Hausa, Yoruba, and Igbo being the major languages. The official dialect of China is Mandarin, also called Putongwa, out of 276 indigenous languages. More than 70% of the Chinese population speaks Mandarin, but there are also several other major dialects in China. To mention but a few are Yu, Xiang, Min dialect, and Gan. Nigeria's currency is called the Nigerian Naira, while the Chinese Yuan is the currency of China. Speaking of which currency is more powerful, the Chinese Yuan is 59 times stronger than that of Nigeria, as one Yuan equals 59 Naira. When it comes to GDP, Nigeria has a nominal GDP of $443 billion with a per capita income of $2,149. China, on the other hand, has a nominal GDP of $14.9 trillion with a per capita income of $10,839. This makes China's GDP 33 times greater than that of Nigeria. Looking at their military strength, with 0, 0.000 considered perfect, Nigeria is 35th on the world military ranking with a power index of 0.6241 and an annual military budget 
of $2.152 billion. The Chinese military, on the other hand, has the third best military in the world, after USA and Russia, with an annual budget of $477.6 billion and a power index of 0.0854. Looking at the natural resources of both countries, Nigeria's natural resources include petroleum, natural gas, tin, iron ore, coal, limestone, niobium, lead, zinc, and arable land. Nigeria's oil and gas sector, the largest in Africa, accounts for about 10% of GDP, and petroleum export revenue represents around 86% of total export revenue. China, on the other hand, is the country with the most natural resources in the world. 90% of China's resources are coal and rare earth metals. However, timber is another major natural resource found in China. Other resources that China produces are antimony, coal, gold, graphite, lead, phosphates, tin, zinc, silver, and diamond. Both countries have a very good tourism sector. Tourism in Nigeria centers largely on events due to the country's ample amount of ethnic groups, but also includes rainforests, savannah, waterfalls, and other natural attractions. China boasts of a large number of wonderful attractions, including antique sites and relics, imperial palaces, delicate water towns, amazing natural wonders, splendid cultural heritage. And diversified folk costumes. It will take years to visit all of these attractions, but it is fairly easy to tour the top tourist attractions. Decaying infrastructure is one of the deficiencies that Nigeria has had over time. The government has begun to repair the country's poorly maintained transport network, with more attention given to its rail system. China's transport infrastructure, on the other hand, has grown to be the second largest in the world. The country's transport system improved dramatically since 1949. China now has a comprehensive transportation network of airports, trains, highways, subways, ports, and waterways. When it comes to governments, Nigeria is a federal presidential constitutional republic with a three-tier system of government which consists of the executive authority, legislative authority, and judicial authority. China, on the other hand, is a unitary one-party socialist republic. Nigerian cuisine consists of dishes or food items from the hundred of ethnic groups that comprise Nigeria. Like other Western African cuisines, it uses spices and herbs with palm or granite oil to create deeply flavored sauces and soups such as banga soup, eguisi soup, or fada stew, and so many others. The Chinese cuisine are an important part of Chinese culture, which includes cuisines originating from the diverse regions of China, as well as from overseas Chinese who have settled in other parts of the world. Chinese traditional foods are rice, soy sauce, noodles, tea, chili, oil and tofu, and their traditional utensils are chopsticks and wok. We have come to the end of this video. Kindly react to this comparison in the comment section and also state which of them you think is better. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe to our channel if you are yet to. Thanks for watching.